Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Here we go. In today's video you will find out how the price of Bitcoin has changed and what the technical indicators RSI, divergence, stochastic RSI and MACD are showing. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. By taking a closer look at the hourly time frame for Bitcoin, the price went down only slight by about 0.7% in the last 24 hours and has a current price of 23,100. Looking at the hourly relative strength index, the current hourly RSI is at 52, so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. Looking for divergence in the hourly time frame, the price has already gone up owing to the last bullish divergence. Moving to the hourly stochastic RSI, the stochastic RSI currently shows no overbought or oversold conditions, but because the percent %K line is over the percent %D line, we can deduce that the trend is currently on the up. Jumping to the hourly MACD, seeing as the MACD line is above the signal line, meaning that the trend is currently on the up. As we can see from the MACD histogram, the momentum is indecisive at this moment. This means that we can expect for the price to remain the same for some time and you should wait and for the MACD line to cross the signal line. This will mean it's bearish. Moving to the 3 hourly relative strength index, the current 3 hourly RSI is at 47, so there are currently no signs of the crypto being overbought or oversold. Moving to the 3 hourly stochastic RSI, there are no signs of the stochastic RSI being oversold or overbought at this time but because the percent %K line is over the percent %D line, we can deduce that the trend is currently on the up. Looking at the 3 hourly MACD, the trend is currently going down because the MACD line is below the signal line. However, the MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently shifting to the upside and it could be expected that the price will consolidate for some time and you should wait to see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bullish. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price. So please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching and know that every few hours new videos are uploaded analyzing different cryptocurrencies, so be sure to hit subscribe and not miss out. If you have any questions, leave a comment below and we'll get back to you ASAP. Also, Keep in mind that you should make your own investment decisions as cryptocurrency trading is very risky and these daily videos are only an overview of trends and are a purely technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. See you next time.